He's a hometown fighter on the verge of making the big time. We may soon be able to say that Lloyd Woodard is to Missoula what Rocky was to Philly. Hey, they've even got the same girlfriend. But while Balboa had an ironclad nickname, Woodard takes a slightly different approach. From Missoula, Montana, introducing Lloyd Cupcake Woodard. I got the nickname Cupcake uh, from my coach. He was like, don't worry, I just put your name down as Cupcake. We're going to use it this time only, and then you're going to be all right. And I, you know, I mean, I was so nervous, so I just, you know, I just went with it. And uh, after the fight, everybody, like, loved the name, so I just stuck with it. Lloyd Cupcake Woodard is the marquee name for Missoula's Dog Pound fight team. Over the last three years, the Dog Pound has a winning percentage over 90%, but none have been more successful than Woodard. I use him to emulate, essentially, all my coaching and everything else. I bring people in and have them watch Lloyd, watch his footwork, watch his hips. He has that textbook style. If I could duplicate over and over again, it would be Lloyd Wooden. You know, I'm from Montana up here, and, uh, you know what I mean, we, we don't have any big schools. We're here at the Dog Pound right here, you know what I mean? We don't get a lot of recognition, and, like, I'm just happy that I'm in there and I'm showing them that, you know what, Montana boys are tough, you know what I mean? You better watch out for us. This Saturday at 7 p.m., for the second time, Woodard will fight on MTV2 in front of a national audience. At 11-0 as a professional fighter, he's coming off a mid-March victory over Kerry Veneer, thought to be a favorite to win the Bellator Lightweight World Title Tournament, until he met the man from Montana. Big upset! He said he could pull it off, and he did! With that win, Cupcake earned a trip to Saturday's tournament semifinals. If he wins, he'll move on and fight to become the number one contender for the 155 pound world title belt. Being a champion, that's like my ultimate goal. That's what everybody wants in the sport. But to be honest, like the thing that I want the most is just to fight, you know what I mean? That's what I love to do. To Woodard, fighting is a luxury, something he thanks God for every day. Because before he turned pro, he allowed it to be taken from him. I made some really bad decisions. And I sat in jail and in the boot camp and all that just thinking about what I would do when I got out and I promised myself that, you know, I would, I would not fall back into where I was at that moment. With people like Matt Powers and people like all around me, my family here at the Dog Pound, you know, I want to be better for them. I want to be better for the state of Montana. You know, I mean, this is a great town that we live in. It's been the best home to me ever. I'll never like neglect it again or do it wrong or do it harm. And I'm just here to, you know I mean? cupcake, I guess. Woodard's love for Montana shines through on the grand stage in constant shout outs to the treasure state. Uh, that's a lot of intensity. I like the way he finished. He and what may be the most unmistakable mustache in the business. I want to look like a mountain man. I want to look like I'm from Montana. You know what I mean? I love this place. You know what I mean? This this right here reminds me of a uh, Tessie Fest. This right here reminds me of going out on the trail, going back in lakes and stuff. You know what I mean? This, that's just what it reminds me of, and it reminds me of what I'm fighting for. So as Woodard and his Dog Pound crew continue to increase the reputation for fighters across Montana. Montana! Montana! Yeah, Lloyd, we already did that part. Just hold the camera. For fighters from Montana, you can find his fight playing at establishments all across Missoula. Missoula in town! But Lloyd, Lloyd, give me the camera. That's, what? Let's what? try. I'm trying to, you know, entertain everybody so they can be welcome to MMA and like see how exciting it is because it right. is really exciting especially when you know somebody like everybody in Montana like come and watch me because you know me you know what I mean <laughs> you come see me I live right above Faruqi's bar